three companies were raided last Friday for reportedly transferring cash from a public fund to Malaysian Prime Minister Najib Razak's personal bank account, Attorney General Abdul Ghani Patel said on Saturday. The raids came after an article was released by Wall Street Journal alleging Najib received $900 million into his personal accounts between 2013 and 2014 from three companies connected with the One Malaysia Development Bearhood, One MDB, state fund. Malaysian police conducted a raid against three companies, SRC International SDNBHD, Gandingan Mentari SDNBHD and Isan Pertina SDNBHD, which were said to be involved in the transactions, the Attorney General said. Denying all claims Najib Razak said on his Facebook account Friday that it is a political sabotage. He continued saying that I have never taken funds for personal gain as alleged by my political opponents and adding that his attackers would face with the full force of the law. He also blamed former Premier Mahathir Mohamad for working hand-in-glove with foreign nationals to unseat him. In the event that the allegations are proven true, Mr. Najib will be the first Prime Minister who has been directly subject to siphoning money from public funds. Malaysian Defence Minister Datuk Seri Hishamuddin Hussein said on Sunday that the Malaysian Anti-Corruption Commission, MACC, the police and Bank Negara should be allowed to carry out their investigation due to the corruption claims just based on media reports. He warned Malaysian people, saying do not act hastily and immediately accuse the Prime Minister because the claim is based on media reports, which have yet to be verified. Do not make any speculations because it will only worsen the situation. Hishamuddin believed that the investigations would be conducted promptly and fairly without any doubt. After handing out Harry Raya donations to police personnel at the Hilir Perak District Police Headquarters, Home Minister Datuk Seri Dr. Ahmed Zahid Hamidi said on Saturday that the Prime Minister should take action against Wall Street Journal's baseless money transferring claims, according to the law. WSJ as an influential and respected media institution should provide solid evidence before making such a serious allegation, he said. According to Dr. Ahmed Zahid, action should be taken against any media outlet which publishes or broadcast information which based on non-credible sources to create a fake public sense against government and country. The One Malaysia Development Bearhood, One MDB, state fund were founded by Najib Razak in 2009 to attempt strategic initiatives to sustain the country's economic development by forging global partnerships and encouraging foreign investments. But shortly after Najib Razak established the fund, it has remained in the center of the criticism over its debt of more than $15 billion and the inability of its financial management.